<laughs> All right, with real estate values on the Sun Coast, uh, they're being on the rise. There are still foreclosures and short sales available. And today we'll take you inside two flipped homes and give you tips on how to find a great value. Expert house flippers say it takes a vision. This was the kitchen cabinet. This was a pantry. This is where the refrigerator was. Broker and home flipper James Adkins gives us an inside look into one Bradenton foreclosure he's already in the process of renovating. Walls were torn down to create space for that coveted open floor plan and dream kitchen. 175 cost acquisition, about 50 into it for renovation, and now listed between 275 and 300. With a team of contractors, Adkins plans to have the kitchen, new roof, flooring, renovated pool and upgraded bathrooms done in 30 days. For those in the market to purchase a foreclosure, Adkins says first things first. Find yourself a good contractor, carpenter, or handyman that you can trust and work through the numbers before you start the buying process. Flips can turn to flops if you're not careful before buying, especially if you don't have the money to fix big problems you may not be expecting. Number one, avoid wood frame houses if possible. Number two, unless you have to have a pool, don't necessarily get a house with a pool. Number three, always inspect the roof from the top, which means you got to get on the roof. For many home buyers, it's hard to see a finished and upgraded product. Down the street, this Bradenton home's yard was overgrown, had an outdated kitchen and dingy flooring. Now that it's modern, the home is nearly unrecognizable. Modern design, all the trends that we see in the marketplace are for the open concept where the kitchen is essentially the heart of the home. All those renovations earn the owner a nearly $40,000 profit. And if you don't want to flip a property yourself, there are always advantages to buying one already completed. So if you think about it, buyers are typically having to come to the table with a down payment plus closing costs. Very few buyers would have $25,000, $30,000, $40,000, $50,000 to put into the house after closing. So that's where the benefit lies. I love seeing these before and afters, and like Andrew said, if you don't want to put in the work yourself or hire a contractor, you can always buy a flipped home with all those new amenities that you see in all the new homes that are popping up, too. So. It's scary, though. I mean, you can have the vision, but then once you get into <laughs> it and find out, yeah. you know, this needs to be moved and that doesn't work. And that's why he says go with someone that's trained and knows yeah. what to look for and watch out for those big things because that's where they could be the money pit. I've never been that brave. <laughs> <laughs> I've never had any kind of vision. <laughs> Still had a good morning, Sun Coast. The new Android ad is going viral. More on that.